shred! My leg! Let's get the hell out of here! You think they're done out there? We don't want any trouble. Not anymore, at least. Oh, just peek your head up. You damn coward. To heck with that. I'm too pretty to go. Is it over? Well, that could have gone worse. <laughs> I don't know. Seemed quite the performance from where I was standing. Are you fucking high or something? Why am I asking? Of course you are. Was still winning the fight, wasn't I? You're strung out and getting sloppy is what you are. Of course, I suppose you ain't got to worry about that now. Seems this one just put us out of business. I'm not sure if I should kiss you or have my little bird here feed you your own entrails. I told you to quit calling me that. I saved your lives. You should be grateful. Grateful? For killing our meal ticket? Excuse me if I don't rush to embrace our savior. They weren't the friendliest bunch, but keeping those idiots entertained, at least kept the lights on. To hell with them. More'll come. Just need a quick breather and I'll be ready to go. Oh, breather? What? So you can slam more of that junk into your arm? Now, now, you know what? I think this was a blessing in disguise. You caught the end of that bout. What'd you think of Kate's work? She's clearly talented. See? At least someone knows skill when they see it. It ain't your fighting skills I'm concerned with. So here's my predicament. I suddenly got no audience. No audience means I got no caps coming in. And if you ain't bringing in caps, little bird, you ain't an asset. You're a liability to me and to yourself. So here's what I'm thinking. What say I let you take over her contract? She goes with you. Watches your back. Look, you'd be doing me a favor while I try to get the place back in order. What do you say? Me? And him? Why would you want her to go with me? Yeah, Tommy. Just why the hell are you trying to get rid of me? <sighs> Look, the truth is, all that junk, it's been making you careless. And I don't want to be the one doing color commentary when you finally hit the floor. All right? So just do me this favor. Both of you. Please. I'd like to know what Kate thinks. Don't I get a say in all this? That ain't how a contract works. Besides, you really want to stay here? No audience, no caps, no one to talk to, but yours truly. Jesus. Point taken. Atta girl. So, she's on board. Now what about you? Sure. I could use someone watching my back. Good. It's settled then. And here, take this. It's the purse from the last fight. Exterminator's fee. Now just wait a second. What exactly are you gonna do without me here? You don't need to worry about me. I'll get this place set up right. Maybe find a less blood-soaked clientele. Now get the hell out of here. You ain't welcome anymore, little bird. You're a real son of a bitch. You know that, Tommy. You don't have to tell me. I guess you just come find me then when you want to head out. How's it going, Tommy? 
Can't say I miss the crowds, but I sure miss their caps. Suppose someone should make use of it. Hey, Kate. So, you're ready to head out? That depends. How are you feeling? I dunno. Feeling kinda useless sitting here with me thumb up me arse. So, are you ready to get this show in the road? Not now. Have it your way. Kate. So, you're ready to head out? I just wanna trade a few things. What am I? A bank. Why bother with that? You open in a museum or something? Coming to you from uh, the jewel green. I mean, the green. Uh, I mean, the uh, the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. It's Diamond City Radio. This is a song about easy living. Just, just like here in Diamond City, am I right? Don't answer that. 